Hi everyone, welcome back to Vegan Delicious. Today we will be doing some tofu scramble and some home potatoes. We hope you like this video and you comment and you subscribe. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start with the video. So for our tofu scramble, we're gonna need a block of tofu. Um, it's better if you get a firm tofu, but you can go ahead and use any tofu that you like. We will need some nutritional yeast. We need two tablespoons of nutritional yeast. We need one teaspoon of turmeric and one teaspoon of paprika. We are going to use uh, bell peppers. We are using about half a cup or a cup of bell peppers. And we are using a cup of tomatoes. So you're just gonna chop this finely. And let's go ahead and start with our tofu scramble. So to begin with our tofu scramble, we're gonna go ahead and put our pan and our stove to medium high. We're gonna go ahead and add a little bit of oil to our pan. We are going to incorporate our vegetables just so they cook before we put our tofu in. You can also go ahead and use spinach for this, but if you are using spinach, you can um, incorporate the spinach at the end. So your spinach can be the last step, just because the spinach tends to cook really uh, fast. So you're just gonna go ahead and cook this for a couple of minutes. Just make sure that they're very well cooked. Now that we left our vegetables cooked for about two, three minutes, we're gonna go ahead and incorporate our tofu. For our tofu, we're gonna go ahead and crumble it up. So just like you see here, we're gonna go ahead and crumble our tofu up. This is just giving it the like an egg texture. You can go ahead and chop it up, but it's easier if you just crumble it up. It's very convenient as well. You're gonna go ahead and put this uh, lower. Just lower your heat and go ahead and mix everything together. You are gonna go and uh, let this cook for about two minutes. All right, so after about two to three minutes, you're gonna go ahead and add your spices. So nutritional yeast, paprika, We're gonna go ahead and add some salt. This is optional. If you do like salt, you can add some salt and some pepper. This is going to be uh, giving it the yellow color that egg has and also the flavor that egg has. You're just gonna go ahead and mix everything together. Just make sure that you mix well because sometimes some of, of the parts of the tofu are more yellow than the others. So just make sure you mix everything together. And let this cook for about a minute. Um, after a minute, you should be able to tell that it's already done. We don't want to overcook it. And also, if you were to add some spinach, now it's the time to add the spinach. We are not adding some spinach today, but you can add it. It's a great... A source of vitamin and also it gives it a really good taste all right it's been a minute and I think we are done so we're gonna go ahead and turn off our stove and this is how it looks all right so for our home potatoes we are going to need a pan or 
we're gonna turn, turn the stove on. We're gonna add our potatoes. And we're gonna season our potatoes. Um, I'm gonna add a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. And I'm going to add a little bit of water so they cook. I'm gonna mix it. So most of our potatoes have the pepper. And I'm gonna let them cook by covering it. So after a couple of minutes, we're just gonna make sure we mix the potatoes so they all cook um, at the same time. So we're just gonna mix it a little bit. So they are uh, well cooked. And we're gonna cover again and wait for a few more minutes. All right, so after like two minutes, we can check our potatoes again. And they're pretty soft. So if I overcook them, they're gonna get like mushy and I don't want that consistency. So I'm gonna uncover them so the water evaporates and then I can add a little bit of oil and the uh, bell pepper. Okay, so as you can see, our water evaporated already, most of it. So I'm gonna lower the heat and I'm just gonna make sure it doesn't have water anymore. And I like to like open space in the middle and that's where I add a little bit of oil, not a lot. I wanna say about one tablespoon of oil. I don't like my potatoes that oily. And I'm gonna add the pepper in the middle so it it's crunchy and because I added the bell peppers and you guys can add onions. I know onion gives it a really good flavor. I'm not gonna use onion because not everyone likes onion, but if you love onion, just add onion. All right, so like I said, I like my bell peppers and my potatoes a little crunchy. I don't like when they are overcooked. I think my potatoes are done. And that's it. So I'm gonna turn the stove off. And I was ready to serve. All right, so I serve our tofu scramble and our home potatoes already. I added some slices of avocado and sprinkle a little more of pepper. And now I'm gonna try it. Mmm, very good. Very good. I hope you guys like this recipe and I hope you try making it. If you do, comment, like, please subscribe and thank you for watching our video. Oh, honey.